Hi Leo, welcome to your mid-month reading for December. This is going to be for Leo, Sun, Moon, Venus and Rising. These messages are general. So they may or may not resonate with you. If it doesn't, you can always check your other placements to see what else comes up for you for mid-December. What's going on with Leo and their love life? Give me messages for Leo. Okay, we have soulmates. The, yes, this is your soulmate. We have you deserve love. You are lovable. Messages for Leo. We have finance and career. Financial issues are a factor in your love life right now. Sorry about the noise. We have finance, sorry, not finance, healing family issues. Your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. Also, true love, this is the romance of a lifetime. So, there is a soulmate in your energy or coming towards you, whom you deserve, but you may be dealing with some financial issues or this person may be. They could also have childhood issues that they're dealing with this person, but let me see what's going on with them. What's this person's energy towards Leo? What's their energy towards Leo for mid-December? So they seem to be at a standstill. Some of you are dealing with someone who isn't really making any moves. They have to deal with a tower moment. So they may have had a setback financially that caused this, you know, this tower moment for them, causing them to have to be at a standstill. And for some of you, we have the fool. So it seems like they are eventually going to take a leap. But right now they just seem to be at a standstill. They seem kind of stuck here, so they, I guess, I, f I get the feeling that they're trying to figure it out at the moment. What's Leo's energy towards their person? Leo's energy towards their person. Yeah. Some of you, there might be some red flags that you're ignoring. I'm hearing for some of you that you're dealing with someone who kind of runs when a problem arises. And some of you know that this is a red flag, but you're kind of not really paying it much attention. You know that they um, have become emotionally distant. So some of you may also be matching that energy and trying to distance yourself emotionally as well. What went on in the recent past for Leo, what went on in the recent past with Leo? Some of you may have dealt with your own financial issues in the recent past. Now dealing with someone who is dealing with financial issues. In the past, they may have, some of you are dealing with someone who may have already left you out in the cold before and rejected offers from you. So that's why the Two of Swords is here, because some of you might be kind of ignoring the fact that, or not take, just not take it into consideration, the fact that they have left you out in the cold before. And this might be their pattern, is what I'm hearing. What is the energy of this connection? What's the energy of this connection for Leo? Six of, oh my goodness. So you might be helping this person. Some of you are helping someone financially or just giving them more energy, more of your energy than you need to if they are someone who has left you before, right? And some of you know, like you are trying to not give too much of yourself away, but at the same time, you kind of are. We have the strength. It could be a fellow Leo. But some of you feel like you can just handle it if you have to. If you, if, well, if you love them enough, I guess. Let me see. Okay, why did this deck choose to do this? Give me some insight for Leo. 
I knew there was a card still flipped. Three messages for Leo. All these cards are new, so they just slide around the table. So we have paradise, happiness, expansion, joy, playfulness, oneness, enjoying each other. We also have boats, receiving what you need, progression, arriving, moving on, closure, closure issues, not enough, frustrated in relationship, lack of confidence, self-sabotage, fear, ego, and jealousy. So this connects with the family issues card. Some of you may be dealing with someone who has these issues, jealousy issues, um, self-confidence, but it could be vice versa. We have a situation where some of you are needing closure at least. We have coffee cup. Meeting, conversing, savoring the moment, feeling uplifted and friendship. So reconnecting with friends, getting help from friends as well for your situation. Let me look at your main spread because it's just complicated things. <laughs> Okay, Leo. Give me, oh my goodness, really? Give me messages for Leo from mid December. Give me a spread for Leo, mid month December. What's going on in their love life? For mid December. Some of you are feeling like you've lost something, but you're not focusing on the fact that you actually can move forward with or without this person. We've got the Knight of Wands as the overall energy. This is your energy as a fire sign. You could be dealing with the Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, but you're definitely on the move. You will definitely move forward if you feel you have to. Again, this person has a tower. They seem to have had a tower moment, like something shocking happened to them. Um, st very suddenly and unexpectedly, they could have been evicted or something like that, where they need help. And some of you might be helping this person in some way. It doesn't have to be financially, but their feelings for you, page of pentacles. So these are feelings in the, in the making, but some of you need to be careful of being used financially if you are taking care of someone financially because in their feelings it seems to just be i mean pentacles so it's like they need something from you we have sagittarius energy and pisces and cancer they are seeing you as temperance someone who has a lot of patience and a good heart but you are admiring this person more than what they're showing you, okay? So six of wands and the seven of swords. Some of you are seeing this person as a seven of swords, like they're using you or taking, draining your energy or your finances. Um, some of you may feel, may, may feel used, like you may already realize that this person has Come into your life for their own, you know, gain. Some of you, there may be a new person coming into your life with that soulmate card. If the current person is someone who used you, if the past person used you and you're with someone now and there's no red flags, this person could be the soulmate. But whoever is showing you that they were not in it for you, not in it for the right reasons, then they are not the soulmates, okay? It could never be the soulmate. So let me see. 
Why the Five of Cups? Why is Leo in the Five of Cups energy? Page of Pentacles. In reverse, so lack of communication, but we also have the sun here. Some of you may have a child with this person, but there, there has been a lack of communication making you feel like you've lost this person or that they've taken from you. You've suffered some losses because of them. Why the page of pentacles is this person's feelings? Why they feel on the page of pentacles? For some of you, they this could be a person who returned to you. This could be someone who did leave you in the past and, and came back. They returned. And for them, it's like the feelings have started all over again. They've had to start all over again um, reconnecting with you. And as I said, if this is someone who needed a favor, needed a place to stay, um, they might not be doing it for the right reasons. They always say, um, male or female, but they always say, no one falls in love faster than a man who needs a place to stay. Okay. That's when, I mean, it almost happened to, well, it didn't almost happen to me. I saw it and I shut it down, you know. As soon as they need, feel like they need a place to stay, they'll profess their love to you. They'll fall in love so fast. You know, not real love, obviously. But just be careful who you are helping because they might not be in it for the right reasons leaving you feeling drained why the six of wands why the six of wands and this can also go for because i'm hearing now this can also go for someone who just went through a breakup they could be using you as a rebound you know so be careful of that maybe their girlfriend or boyfriend suddenly left them and now they just need someone to take their mind off of that person just be careful of users in general okay because you may have a soulmate on the way for you because you deserve love that's why this card is here and you don't deserve to have someone just come in and use you as if you're not even human okay six of wands some of you, this person may have just gone through a divorce or you may have just gone through a divorce. You could be vulnerable. For some of you, this could be someone you used to be married to or was in a relationship with, as I said earlier, but some of you may be wrapped up in the whole, you know, they're finally back, we're reconnecting, you know? So just be careful of the users. Why the Seven of Swords? Why is Leo seeing this person? A seven so see queen of pentacles they are not secure right now they're not final financially secure they're looking for someone to put their burden on to carry their burden for them for a while why the chariots why the chariot you see five of swords as what's blocking oh boy Knight of Wands. Why the Five of Swords? Why is the Five of Swords blocking? Yeah, this is. Be careful. This person may try to 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 really come up at your expense. It's how in reverse them trying to rebuild themselves. Them kind of reconciling but not really reconciling because the five of swords is here so they're kind of just taking and you are seeing them this way seven of, of swords so some of you are aware why the tower why is this person in the tower energy what was the tower moment for this person temperance in reverse yeah if you're dealing with a female, they may have had someone taking care of them, or even if they're a male, but I feel more so female. They may have had someone taking care of them at one point, and they may have got cut off financially from that person. Now looking for someone 
some other sucker is what I'm hearing to pick up the pieces and take over. So this this is a person looking for someone with a good heart who gives a person that they would consider to be a sucker. Okay? So don't be that don't be that person. But they have suffered some kind of financial loss here. That's their tower moment or any kind of loss. It could even be that they have no, that they're narcissistic and don't have any supply anymore and need new supply. Just be careful. Why, why temperance? Lovers in reverse. Some of you may have, may be vulnerable. The death card in reverse could be dealing with a Scorpio or a Gemini, but they're seeing you as quite giving and quite vulnerable. Why the moon? Especially if you've told them about your past pain, they might be just using that as a guideline. Why the moon as the outcome? Six of Wands coming out triumphant, but some of you are going to be with the moon. You may you may start to realize what's what's been hidden, what what their true intentions are. This may cause some anxiety and some pain, some crying. With the Nine of Swords being here, the Ten of Pentacles in reverse, you're going to see that this has been. Something to do with finances. Or even them just needing just needing your energy. But I see you coming out on top as long as you don't fall for this. And if you already have fallen for this and you're here because of that, you still have the soulmate card. So there still is a soulmate coming towards you because you deserve love. If you're current, will, currently with someone who is not this person here, then that this new person could be the soulmate. Let me see what we got here for Leo. Okay, improving health. So focus on healing if you have already just suffered this situation. We have there's something better, of course. Perfect timing and weight. So in perfect timing, the soulmate is coming along. But there's definitely someone better than this because this person may have used you or is using you. We do still have true love. This is the romance of a lifetime. So I do see a really good connection coming towards you. Especially when we're ending with the six of wands. You getting what you deserve in the end. And not being used by this person. Okay, so Leo, this is what I'm seeing for you. Be careful who you're helping is the main thing here. Because they may be someone who just isn't um, considerate of other people. That's what I'm getting with the healing family issues. They just may be someone who looks for a person to pay their way through life. Okay, so just be careful. Hope this was helpful for you. Check your other placements if you want to know what else to expect. Maybe you can get more insight on who the soulmate is coming towards you. Or if it's the current person that you're with. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.